Hey guys, so this is a short about my previous short. I've uploaded some of this gameplay before to my community, or I've been seen playing it while streaming in VC or something. People always ask me what kind of game mode is that for War Thunder. This isn't War Thunder. This game is to War Thunder what Armor 3 is to Call of Duty. So this is a game called Isle 2 Storm of it, and it's best experienced in VR. It's a long running series that's been going since the early 2000s. It's made by Gaijin Entertainment, and War Thunder is basically a more arcadey version of this. The game was really popular with aircraft enthusiasts and also World War II history buffs. So at some point they realized that they could market it as an MMO and then you had War Thunder. Now even War Thunder sim battles is nothing like this game. A bit of a hot take but War Thunder is incredibly unrealistic. This game has better flight and damage models. It doesn't have naval combat yet and it never really has. Tanks are a new addition but the flight and damage models of this game is far superior to War Thunder. But before you go and pick it up, there's currently a couple versions of IL-2 Stormovic available. If you're coming over from War Thunder it might be a bit frustrating for you. It's not really a plug and play game and you might not be used to all of the simulation of it. Some aircraft you can break by just flying too fast and turning. There's a lot of in-depth mechanics but luckily you can turn everything down and make it sort of more of a arcadey experience. But even at this game's most arcadey level it's still much more realistic than War Thunder.